On the 18th of December, um, we were staying with my mom and I came out of the bathroom, I tripped on a floor runner and I fell head first into a door jam. It happened in a heartbeat. Like it literally happened in less than a second. Your, your entire life can change in less than a second. The Evergreen Health 14-Bed Acute Rehabilitation Unit, or ARU, is the only dedicated licensed inpatient facility on the east side for patients who may have suffered stroke, brain injury, multiple sclerosis or Parkinson's, hip fracture, or a progressive neurological disorder. The ARU takes a comprehensive interdisciplinary approach to recovery. People don't plan to become a patient in the ARU, but life can throw a curveball. I was in the best shape I'd ever been in. And all of my friends said, when they heard I had a stroke, it was like, out of all of us, you're the most fit and, and you eat the best. And it just doesn't make sense that this happened to you. Those who find themselves in the ARU, they're the lucky ones. Physical, occupational, and speech therapists join certified rehabilitation nurses and physicians to provide care 24-7. Patients spend an exhausting three hours a day in rehab. I like to tell people that uh, um, March 14th, 2012 was the worst day of my life and the best day of my life. Worst day because I had the stroke, but the best day because I ended up at Evergreen. When people come to us, a life-changing event, uh, something that people did not expect. So it wasn't they were expecting their life to go, be going one way and, oh, I'll end up in acute rehab unit. You know, this is something that was unexpected for them and their families. And they come to our rehab unit and um, I like to, to think that we give them hope that it's okay, they're gonna get back to their lives, they're gonna get back to their homes, they're gonna get back to their communities. Patients give everything they've got to therapy while fending off sadness and discouragement. I would look forward to my husband every day coming to see me and looking forward to going home, but beyond that, I didn't have any hope. Sometimes you dreaded having your family see you because you were gonna be that bad off by the time they did, which is fine, you know. So it was better sometimes not to see them. The acute rehabilitation unit here at Evergreen is a wonderful staff, but our facilities are really lacking. Your generosity tonight will enable big changes in the ARU. Open spaces for meals and socializing will allow greater mobility, helping families develop coping skills and reclaim intimacy. Even more exciting, a specialized home transition apartment will give patients and families a chance to try out new skills in the privacy of the apartment with nursing staff just down the hall. The apartment will be a great asset for the patients to be able to practice using a regular bed, using a bathroom that's not modified for wheelchair use um, to learn how to, to, to transfer the skills they've learned here into more um, home-like environment. Our rehabilitation success rate is 7% higher than the national average. More than 80% of our patients successfully transition back to their homes. With a transitional apartment and open concept shared spaces, we'll give our patients even better care sending them home with greater confidence, safety, and success. Picture how this would be if this happened to you or somebody that you were close to, and to watch them go from ER when the neighbor said, you know, you didn't look so good when they hauled you out of your, 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 your whole side was hanging down. I was like, you didn't look so good to the, you know, he doesn't, he doesn't need me. He can drive again, he can work again, he can walk the dogs again. We all have a vested interest in having this facility in our community because any one of us could be in a car accident, could slip on the ice and break a hip, um, have a stroke. Any one of us can get there. If you've ever lived through something like this, you wouldn't have to be convinced. If you've got the funds, you just write, write, write the check right now. With your help, these everyday heroes will make it back to where they belong, home again.